first heard about the availability of Dolby Atmos on the console, I was very excited because it's something that I've always thought would be a perfect fit for this Tomb Raider game. Because we've always talked about verticality in this game and exaggerating that sense of vertigo. This idea of a descent into hell almost is one of the core ideas of the story for the character. The thing that is amazing is when you're exploring some of the fear, claustrophobia for example, or vertigo, and you, you may think that audio has no impact on that, but oh my god, there's a moment in the game, there's a keepu puzzle thing where you have to do a little bit of like Tarzan, you know, you jump, touch, but you are in the emptiness, you're like in the ravine, which it's infinite down. All that sound, the cracking sound that this may be, you know, on top of you, you don't see it, but it's cracking and it may, may give up and have you fall. That makes the feeling of fear even more powerful. We're all conditioned to look at a, at a 2D image and trick ourselves to believe that it's, it's more than a 2D image. But what Atmos and that, and this, this huge soundscape, it makes it feel like that you're in something that is much larger than what you're actually seeing. You can completely almost replicate the idea of something seamlessly traveling by you, above you, below you. If there are enemies that are tracking you just above the water surface, you know, you'll hear those like filtered, but above where you are. It's actually very valuable for, for gameplay to have that extra information. It definitely influences the way that you know we, we build the levels and we build out the uh, environments, for sure, especially from a sound point of view. When I heard the first time the jungle in Dolby Atmos, I was, wow, that's, that's incredible. All these environments are very vertical environments. Like there's a lot of height information that's there in the jungle. You know, all the birds and uh, all that sits in the canopy above the player. When I first heard like, sounds that we'd placed above the, the player to, to play back, I remember getting people into the studio to hear it. You know, you really felt like you were there in those environments. Everything has been hand placed, whether it's birds or insects or foliage or rain drips or just atmospheric sound as well. So for me, walking in there, I could just be in that environment for hours and just, yeah, that could be the game for me. When we build a world, because in video games, that's what you do. You build a world. You don't just build a story, you're building a world. So having audio, having the birds in the jungle, ha hearing all the leaves shuffling around and he cracking in behind and one at the top because there's holly monkeys on top and there's something moving d d below. It, it creates a sense that you are there. And that's what the Dolby Atmos really brings to the media where you're feeling that you are this character, that you are Lara Croft. And the audio is key to that. That's what the audio does in this case. Thank you.